Mm -hmm. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm, the scholarship she 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 had just graduated from the school. It's not from the G. What we we did for her in that scholarship was that the school asked, wrote to G, trying to verify certain information that they've gotten. I don't know, maybe through the internet or through their research, because NCC always does underground back an uh, underground back chest of all Ghanaian athletes who goes there. So they wrote to the GEA asking whether can we confirm whether Matabisa has a manager or whether she has ever received prize money. And having a manager means a professional athlete. And a professional athlete doesn't take doesn't go to US on strength athlete scholarship. So what we did was that we the association wrote back to the school and told the school that no, the kind of manager that you've read on Matabisa issue on Google or on Facebook, it is not the actual type of managers you have in Europe or in America. In Ghana, any guardians can be called a manager or a family member who is supporting her can be called a manager. So all those things they've seen on the re or they've seen and read on the net are not actual managers. They are just her guardians. And the the price money that she has gotten is you were, you were donated it was the cash money was donated to the family members. And that's why she was glad. Because if we didn't, even in the thick of that issue, in the thick of that controversy, this issue came. If GA didn't like her or didn't want her to progress, they were just, oh yes, she has a manager. And that would have been, and, and, and that would have been all. Because the American institution will believe whatever the GA said than whatever any other person will say. But to what end, to what end would they benefit GA? Why did GA not give her this scholarship? She refused to get, she refused to a GA scholarship. She categorically refused to take GA scholarship. As soon as she came back from Nigeria, no, when she completed com, uh, competed in Botswana in two, two, 2003, Professor Dudu started working on her, 2013, working on her for the scholarship, unsolicited. Because she did 204 or thereabout, and that was enough to have gotten her a scholarship for community schools in US. So as soon as she won the gold medal in Nigeria, the scholarship was ready. And executive of GA spoke to her several times. She said she wasn't interested in the scholarship. She was going to go to police service. She was going to go to police service. That is why she rejected the GA scholarship. And uh, how many did the GA scholarship? The president also went to announce that it was a scholarship for her. So yes. Definitely, that scholarship should have come back and then give it to her. No? no, no, no. It was the same scholarship. You see, when the president president speaks upon upon advice from the ministry, and the ministry also got advice from the GA. So the ministry was advised that the GA has secured a sponsor a scholarship for her. By the time the president made that statement, I'm not sure the presidency knew that she had rejected the pre she rejected that scholarship, and it was the same scholarship that the president mentioned. The one that GA was offering her, it was the same question that the, the President Mahama mentioned in his set of additional address in 2015. There was no different scholarship. So that was why that all this controversy came from. It may be, maybe she didn't know it was the same scholarship. If, if she knew it was the same scholarship, she would have come back to, 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 uh, to clear the air. But people, a lot of Ghanaians thought that what the government was, uh, what the President announced in Parliament was different from the, what the GA was giving her. And it was, same, it was the same thing. It was not different. Did GA take her money and that of her family? Money for what? Take whose money? One critical principle of this administration is that we don't even keep at least money. Even when there's money from GOC to be given to at least, we write to the GOC and the GOC to send the money direct into the at least accounts. If at least take money from the RWF, we write to the RWF now, World Athletics, to send the money direct to Atlas account. We don't take Atlas money. For what? We rather have to find money for Atlas. When they came from Nigeria, Professor Dudu asked her to come and sleep in, in his house. Professor Dudu asked his, his own daughter to vacate her room and give the room to Martha to sleep in. Professor Dudu took her daughter's PC and gave it to Martha to study and go to school. Do you think somebody who doesn't like you will give you all those things? 
Someone who doesn't like you will ask a doctor to leave her room for you to come and stay in. Gee, don't, don't take Ghana, Ghana, uh, at least money. This her, one. Her, her mother said you have taken their money and, and that. Uh, she got she a plethora of stories surrounding that. that what money? When the president gave them the money, they gave the money to Richard Akokovi. Now the second general of GOC. They went to Africa to eat, and Prof has stayed back at the Flatter House. Uh, then was the Flatter House then. So they were waiting for him to come at the, uh, the Afrikiko to join them so that they'll have the meals. So they were waiting now when Prof came and the woman asked for the money. That one, I wasn't there that one, so I can't give the first hand information at that place because I wasn't there. But what I heard was that Prof asked her to keep some of the money in bank so that when the girl is going to school, they can use it as a, uh, as a pocket money. And this uh, advice Prof gave to every single athlete who is going to US. Every single person at least going to the U.S. Prof always advised them to save their money. So it was not a unique advice to only matter. It's all at least. You can interview almost all the athletes and ask them what Prof advised them on, on their money issues. So nobody was interested. Even that time, her 3000 something dollars was with Prof. If Prof, had, Prof wanted to take her money, why would Prof give her? That, that money the president gave her, uh, Prof gave her the money. How much, how much is 10,000? Or how much is 7,000? Prof can take you 22,000, one night, $22,000 one night and buy tickets for athletes. And how much will 7,000 do him? If he can take his credit card one evening, he took his credit card, 28,000 US dollars. Do you know how much interest it, uh, the, the bank will charge on the credit card and buy tickets? When we were going to Doha, just last year Doha, he had to buy three tickets. So people should give us a break on that.